buddy. All right. Hey, Rodney, what's up, dude? What's up, fellas? This your moving sale, my friend? Yeah, buddy. All right. How y'all doing? Right. Doing great, I dude. Like your mask. I got one close to it. Excellent, man. Just to get some more light in here. That's cool. Well, I brought my poker money. I bought I some you. stuff. All right, I gotta show you those other chips. And we just bought some nice chips. Yeah. Let's see where I get some power. Yes, my wife Sharon. Hey, how are you, Adam Jones? Adam plays with me and Jr. Adam Jones. Yeah. We played together, at Jr. Okay. This is power plug. Everything's a ghost bowl with a bundle down if you want to, okay? I got some empty boxes that y'all can them. I do have stuff buried. Yeah, you do? I used to coach I'm gonna put this off to the side. I want yeah, this.
I'll do 40 for both. That's about as low as I need to go right now. Now, it's coming 1130. They ain't going, it may be a little bit better, okay? Uh, okay. I hope you have all the Okay, you have all the money. <laughs> she like, I would take that. Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you. I thought I would have These are neat. You can change all your napkins out. Oh, yeah. And you just put, like, little posters, and you can use for Christmas, birthday. They won't be You know, change your little napkins. It's dated, baby. It's definitely dated. I'm going to throw it up. You got this? Have I got it? Yeah, I got it without you. We need to plug it. We'll do a final deal, man. Tell me what you think, then. Bucket of balls, blanket, a couple of electronics. Thing. No, it's a old Windows. Oh, yeah. It's not an iPad. Yep. Old windows. Yep, yep. <clears throat> Think about 25, 30 bucks for delivery for everything? Uh, she wanted to get more on that, on that computer. Mm -hmm. How about, uh, how about 40 for everything? I'll take some stuff out and bring the price down a little bit then. I'll let um, you keep the computer. The computer, uh, Sharon, do you know anything about a racer? I got a back there. Okay. The Acer is good. It was Kaylin's. It was my daughter's. But um, thirty-five balls. You want to get rid of it? All of it. Yeah. Yeah. We want to get rid of all of it. I put the camera back in there. <laughs> yeah, I checked to make sure it was still in there. Yeah, the camera's all in there. I know it is. I didn't see a battery, but I think it has an internal battery, right? Like it charges on something as opposed it. to a separate battery. I I think so. I okay. can't remember. Yes, it's got a charging station. Yeah. Put it down in it. Okay, cool. It charges down in it. Yeah. <clears throat> um, what, about 30. What? I was thinking about 20, so yeah. maybe 25. Later, for what? Still here. 10 for what? What does he want? For Two. everything. Those three things. These three things? Mm hmm. Yeah, well, I'm I okay. I can do 25. You know 25, yeah, because the balls. That's not even open. I, I know think. that electric blanket. This? this? I don't even think it's open, is it? Yeah, it's got names oh, all over the baseballs and stuff like that. Oh, gosh. That is right. So, it's not brand new. 20. 20. Take it. 20? Yeah, okay. See, this is, that's $115. I know it's, I know that's a good blanket. Mm-hmm. I just, it's. Here you go. Yeah. There we go. Thank you so much. Thank you. And what did you put back? That Aspire Windows laptop. What do you want to give for? Um, honestly, I wasn't thinking more than ten dollars because it's a very old version. Give me a ten. Okay. Yeah. Because I don't have any use for it. That don't go in there, does it? Here you go. I'm sorry. I thought I heard you behind me. Sorry. You want me to put it in this bag? I'll get it. I can carry it. <clears throat> yeah, and you probably, it, it, it may still have a bunch of kids stuff on it. <laughs> yeah. It's my daughter's. Well, I'm going to plug it up and um, reboot and then, it and, and listen, stuff like there's that. There's a charger somewhere, but we didn't. I didn't know which one goes to it. I think there's a charger. Yeah. It have a charger. No, it's going to have a, uh, I think a standard ACDC input. Yeah, it's got a regular. Okay. I know I got the paperwork. So it can use a generic charger and oh, whatnot. Good. good. That's what Rod had said. All right, Rodney. Y'all take it easy. Yes, sir. See you, Adam. Thank you. Yeah, good luck with your move.
Give me two dollars. Thank you. Thank y'all. Are pretty much all of them going to be cut? You know what? I don't know. Okay. Um, it looks like a good chunk of them are. I think he wears work boots. That's why. Okay. <laughs> he might get lucky yeah. Of he might have some of the smart boots. Yeah, they're all cut. Okay. That's okay. They're all cut. Yeah. Okay. How much can I give you for the whole box of Legos? $25. 25. Would it help if I told you I was donating it to a first grade teacher? I don't know because she knows what they're worth. And that's really a really good price for those. <laughs> no, that's, it's just, I know what well she's not going to sell it or anything. She literally is doing it for a first grade classroom. I, I don't know though. I'll okay. Ask her. What, what's your offer? Honestly, 20 even. Twenty even. Oh, she knows what they're worth. I thought she meant my first grade teacher. I was like, my first grade teacher don't know anything about what they're worth. Twenty. All right. Is that a GoPro? Yes, sir. One, two, three, four. Thank y'all. Paige just told me yesterday, I need blocks, building blocks. Just yesterday she told me that. So this whole box I'm gonna give to her. Thank y'all. You're welcome. It's an Android. May I have the toad as well? Do y'all want to keep the... Thank you. Hmm? You got the toad. Mm-hmm. Hey, how are you? Good, how are you? Doing wonderful. Do you mind if I record? It's for a YouTube channel. I'll turn it off if you don't. If um, you mind. I don't mind, but are you documenting your life? Yeah, uh, I like to show people what I find at estate sales and yard sales oh, and stuff okay. like that. That's neat right there. That's neat. What, um... Shopping for others. 
Since today's the second day, is there a percentage off? Oh, well, today's the fifth day. Fifth we're day? Here, we oh. We were here last weekend, so yes. Okay, everything cool. Everything is at least 50% off. Okay, okay. And grouping of stuff from here and not even total $10. Yes. Um, I'm thinking that if you can get all the, those tennis rackets into a bag, mm -hmm. all of them for $10. Yeah, okay. Um, and anything that's already in the tub, the whole tub is five dollars. Okay, okay. The tub alone costs eight. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Ooh. Oh man. Look at that. I wonder if they would sell all this for five dollars in the tote. You know what I mean? Fifteen dollars. Five dollars. Oh, if that alone is five dollars, you can sell that entire piece for five dollars. Yeah, I think you're right, but you know what? It doesn't hurt to ask, you know. Look at this. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let me get a ten dollar bag. The garage. She said the garage stuff was ten dollars. This isn't in the garage, though. So. This Donald Duck plush is really cool. This is old. This is from, let's see if there's a date. There's no date, but I know it's old. Hi. Hey, how are you? How y'all doing? Good, how are you doing? Five dollars, nineteen eighty-six. It says nineteen eighty-four. Actually, man alive, I would be up to my neck in Hot Wheels. Look at those minifigures. Those aren't Lego minifigures, though. This is called Block Tech. I don't know what Block Tech is. You know, considering the fact that these things are still here. Huh? Yeah. Hold this bag for me, please. I'm going to put these right here. I'll see if they'll take. Ten dollars for all those hot wheels. If they see what they ask. Would you look at that? All these baseball cards. Look at that team of the '90s, Atlanta Braves, 1995 World Champions. That's an old-looking camera. Oh yeah, it is. I want 20 bucks a piece. Is that John Smoltz? Sure enough is. That's neat. Uh-oh. Signed baseball. Who is it? Unknown. Oh, Mike Mord Mordecai. I do not. Sorry, I don't recognize that name. I had... The entire upper deck, um, oh, very close to this. In fact, I would I would tell you this was mine. <laughs> Braves baseball cards. It was all the same year, but I want to say the year I got was the year they were in the playoffs or the championships. Yeah, that's really cool. A real Braves fan here. Sports collectible. Yeah. <laughs> Good deal. I'll see if I can talk to Miss yeah. Ann about those Hot Wheels cars. Rainbow Brights, they want $16 a doll. Y'all looking for anything specific? Well, the, um, it's probably already gone. I didn't know you had been open for so long. There was a ceramic Christmas tree I saw posted, and I think it's called a, it's not a harpsichord, but it's a white musical instrument, electrical musical instrument. That's the only thing I've seen. Omnicord, that's what it is. Yeah. What's the price on it? Uh, 200. 200. Okay. 
Yeah. Um, and as far as the ceramic Christmas tree, I haven't seen it, so it probably sold the very first day. Yeah. Okay. Uh, well, two hundreds more than I was wheeling, so I'm just gonna leave that there anyway. I mean, we can we can wheel a deal. Um, if it's priced at two hundred, I'm afraid you wouldn't want to go down to as low as what I wanted to pick it up for. I'm kind of cheap. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, there's some clothes in here. Let me check it out. Suspenders to scarves for a must mark. What are shorts? Is there a price for shorts? Yes. What is it? Five. Five dollars? Yeah. All these shirts are nice. What are polos? Shirts, five dollars. Really? I bet you there's a discounted price though because of the um, day that it is. On the last mark? Oh, is that a stain on there? There's a little stain right there. See it? No. Look, there's a stain there, stain there, stain there, stain there. I'm going to leave that one behind. Let's see if there's any stains on here I'm missing. On a white shirt, stains usually jump out at you, you know? But I don't see one. Okay. Orvis shirt, Orvis shorts. What size are these? 42, that's a big boy size. Orvis, these are all. Okay, I'm gonna give you a job. Hold on to this, but there's something ceramic in there. Don't let it bang around, okay? I'll skip by all this. Okay, switch places with me. Orvis. Bunch of Brooks Brothers. Uh, Cole Hahn, Cole Hahn, kind of beat up. Alan Edmonds. What are shoes? See what else they got. Allen Edmonds Sedona. Are these in great condition? I don't think so. I'm gonna leave them. Are there supposed to be pink bottoms? Yeah, this is the sole. Are you telling me those shoes are living? Oh, Allen Edmonds Lake Forest. Did you get my goat? Yeah, they're leave, living with the soul. Look through those shirts for Orvis. O-R-V-I-S. Can't see the size. You took out another butt, so. I, I, and I brought you uh, part of both. That way you two different. That makes you 11? I don't know. These, all the shoes are like eight. Or eight and a half. Okay. Some of them, I'm just having a hard time finding the exact size. Oh, there's an eight and a half on that one. Okay. I'll leave those. 
All right, so Blake and I made it out of there with our arms pretty much loaded. He's got a bag full of goodies and I got a ba uh, arms full of Orvis clothes and a really cool wool vintage blanket. And I paid $30 for everything. This blanket's one of those vintage wool ones that'll go for about 100 to 125 on eBay. And uh, then all the other stuff, it, they, she pretty much was giving it away, wasn't she? Yeah. Excellent. All right. All right. So let's see what that blanket was worth. Early's, Early's Whitney Point blanket. There's 21 search results. Bidding wars 35 51. 125? Oh, 125, that's no bids. One. Yeah, that's the same blanket, isn't it? Pink with stripes. 170, 152, 140, 130, 145. That's close to pink with a stripe. Yeah. Okay. But oh look, there's that's the that is the one. That that's the one we picked up. 150. Okay. We got that for five. Five dollars. She wanted five dollars. Okay, for, let's see what's sold. That's the important part. You gotta see what's actually sold. Whoa! There were 21 listed and 34 are sold. That means that that sell-through rate, ratio. that sell-through rate is amazing. Okay, so let's see here. Well, let's pay attention and see what sold in a buy it now phase. So 17 sold buy it now. 145, 150, 150, 150, 140, 100. Whoa, that's not a blanket though. That's a jacket of some type. 145, 100. Oh, I'd say that was a great pickup for only $5. And we are done with our yard sales for the day. You want to see everything that we got? At the first yard sale, we picked up one, two, three, four items. I paid $30 for these four items. And this is a 10-inch Acer Windows machine, Acer Aspire 1D255. It's going for about $40 to $50. I'm sure it, it has to work, right? I hope it works. Uh, it didn't come with a plug, but it takes a micro USB. I got plenty of those. I'll test it out. This is a Sunbeam warming blanket, and it's got all the parts in it. They assured me it still worked. Um, I happen to know this guy, a friend of, friend of mine that I go play cards with, so I trust him. And the original price was $119.99. Again, I paid $30 for everything. I got this Olympus digital camera. It's a model is FE4000. And I think it's going for about $30 to $35 on eBay. And then I got a bucket of baseballs. So I didn't get an individual price on these things. We just grouped them all together and paid 30 bucks for everything. And these baseballs may be about 20. All right, the next garage sale, I got two things. I got this bucket of Legos. It is a big tote. It's a, I don't even know how many gallons this tote is, but it's a big tote. It's the size I use for my inventory. So I got the tote and all of the Legos for $20 not very good at guessing weight i'm not one of those who works at the circus and guesses weight but i'm gonna give the majority of these to my wife who needs them for her first grade classroom but then whatever's left over i'm gonna sell as a in a pound in like maybe 10 pounds of legos for 45 50 60 bucks and then i found this ncaa football 2013 and it's in good condition. I wouldn't say it's in great condition, but it's definitely in playable condition. And I only paid $2 for it, and it's I've already sold one like it recently for $35. So next we went to the flea market out in Alabama, and I bought some personal items, but I also bought uh, this Southern Tide polo shirt, good condition. I checked it for holes and stains at the flea market. I am very weary about getting clothes at the flea market. But I checked this one over and it's in great condition. He only wanted a dollar so I paid for it. And then this Patagonia trucker hat, snapback trucker hat, 
It does have something on the bill right there. I believe I can wash that off easily. And it's got a little bit of fade, but it looks, otherwise it looks in pretty darn good condition. And I'm not sure exactly how much they're going for. I'm gonna guess somewhere between 15 to $20. I only paid a dollar. And last place I went was an estate sale. I made out like a fat cat at this estate sale. I paid $2 an article of clothing and there's six, so that's $12. And this is all Orvis. Orvis pants, Orvis shorts, 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 and a polo shirt. $2 a piece. That's better than Goodwill prices. And um, I can't recall how much they're all going for, but at least $20 uh, an item up this is i believe a vintage usa olympics sweatshirt hoodie it says jc penny exclusive it may be from 1996 i'm not 100 percent sure it is pre-owned it does have a little bit of stitching done right here but that's okay because i'm still going to try to sell it for about 20 bucks i only paid two dollars here's a ceramic mold Atlantic uh oh gotta be careful uh, look keep an eye out for the Atlantic mold and I saw their pictures advertised on Facebook they had a ceramic Christmas tree but it wasn't there this was their fifth day I'm sure that went really quickly this particular tray I found a sold lit uh, no I'm sorry I sold another listing for $40 I didn't see any sold listings. I bet you when it comes time for Christmas, you'll see these fly off the shelf. Now, I picked up these plush because they're vintage. They're like, they're 80s for sure. They're not going for much, but I didn't pay a whole lot for them. All right. I bought this remote for a dollar, I think. I'm not sure. Oh, I should say, everything you see here, I paid $25 include um, everything including the remote and these shoes i don't think this remote's going to go for much i picked it up just because i threw it in my bag but it's probably six seven bucks tops i might not even list it now these i paid five dollars for this pair of shoes individually it's um because she rang it up as a single item for five bucks see if can you see it in there it says alan edmonds kenwood and they're a black loafer I paid five dollars and they're going for around somewhere between 90 to 120 and these are in really nice shape they took care of them they're not worn a whole lot just a couple times i'm going to list it for 115 dollars and see what happens and then the big winner right here is this early's whitney point wool blanket made in england they had a price tag of $150 on it and it was in the closet and I was very, I didn't even really want to look at it at all because of that price tag they had on it. But on my way out, I went ahead and grabbed it out of the closet and asked them, how much do you want for this blanket? And she said $5. So I haven't opened it up yet to see if there's any holes, but I do see a few marks on them. But I have seen sold comps on eBay for this blanket for $150. And that's the pick of the day. Well, that was a great day of estates and yard sales and flea markets, and here's why. I paid a total of $84 for everything in the camera you see right now $84 total for it all and being generous and looking at sold comps I could potentially profit $720 and that is a huge win all right guys you know what to do appreciate you stopping by two dudes picking hit that subscribe button hit that like button and hit the bell and come on back every time you see a new video. All right, guys, y'all stay safe out there and have fun picking.